What's up, YouTube? In today's video, I'm going to show you how to easily rank up your character in Hogwarts Legacy. So don't forget to smash that like button, smash that sub button, and drop a comment. Thanks. I don't know why my character isn't looking at the camera, but it's all good. So, you want to make your way over to this part of the map. Let me pull this thing out. Right here, this corner. Here is... Hogwarts ground, so you go through here. Yada, yada yada. If you have the invisibility spell, I would use it throughout this forest because there's a lot of animals and people waiting to get you. So you go up here and then you make your way to the top right. And right here, as you can see, we have the battle arena. Nice. So once you get here, I recommend you save the game like I did. And as you can see, when you come up to it, nothing happens. That is because you have to destroy 20 vases. Check this out. Very simple. Very easy as well. When in doubt, Revelio it out. Oh, uh oh, uh oh. See? See that guy over there? That's exactly what I'm talking about. And this is the spell I'm talking about. This spell is meta. You need this spell. I'm pretty sure you get it throughout the story because you kind of need it when you sneak past. Pause! I'm not going to say anything. I ain't trying to spoil this game. This game is really good, in my opinion. I actually really enjoy this game. This game gives me the same vibes. As Elden Ring. I said it. Not as good though. No, I'm kidding. We just don't know yet, but. I'm getting Elden Ring vibes from this game. I like it. I said it. We have one more left. Check it out. So once you destroy 20 vases, that should happen. And, um, well, I think it'd be a good idea to save again. Nah, I'm kidding. Take that part off. <clears throat> ah, ah, ah. So once you've unlocked the battle arena, just start it and just do it. And this is realistically, this gets boring at level 20. I can imagine. I'm only level 11, but I can't, I, I can't imagine doing this to level 40. What I recommend to have a... Healthy playthrough is if you're stuck like I am, I kind of, I'm stuck at, uh, you know, this boss. I ain't gonna say much. I ain't trying to spoil it, but I'm stuck. So that's why I thought, hey, might as well come here, practice my, uh, dueling, practice my reaction time, practice my spell combos, yada, 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 all that stuff to get better at the game. If you're not that good at dueling, this is the place to go to. Ugh. Restart challenge. Okay. Alright. This is a lot harder than I thought it'd be. But wow. Am I going to get sweaty by the time I'm done with this? So that. Maybe the best wizard in North America. Let's see if I can even complete one round or one wave. Because right now, I kind of pulled up with no potions, no hoes, but a lot of confidence. Let me know in the comments what your favorite spell is. Yo, why is that spider sweating so hard though? Like, relax. Not even a real human being. Alright. Wave completed. That was really tough. This is really tough, but I got 100 XP. Is it worth it? To be honest... Like I said, I wouldn't grind this to level 40. I would grind this until you think you're ready. But I'm gonna be I'm gonna keep it real. A side quest gives you 150. This gives you 100 and a mission and a main quest mission gives you like 250. Those are the numbers I've been seeing. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope this helps you out. Thanks for watching. Peace. Peace.